Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. My name is Visha and welcome back to It's Visha. So, in today's video, I don't know what we doing, but we doing something because I haven't brought y'all content in like a week since Thanksgiving, which was last week. Um, we just been so busy, like with moving. Um, my husband finally got his orders, literally finally got his orders. Um, trying to like get our place in order, make sure our lights, water, everything is set up before we get there. Um, what else? Yeah, it's just been like, I have been so busy. Every day we're doing something. Thing. Um, yesterday was the only day that I took a rest day. Like, I literally just rest. Um, my kitchen is almost packed up. What else is almost packed up? My pantry, you guys. I finished doing my pantry. The only thing I have to do is, like, do my, um, my moving like my bags that i use for when i go grocery shopping i don't even think i'm gonna put them in a box only because my bags are already organized like i just don't have my bags laying around everywhere my bags are like within bag so i might not even put that in a moving box i might just put like throw that in my car somewhere um what else have we been doing so we already had our pre-inspection for them to come out guys it was a whole thing with housing let me let me just tell y'all that if you decide that you want to live on military housing if you're a military spouse y'all take pictures take um take pictures do video recordings like people are like oh you know y'all show everything show it show the freaking world if you have to because they tried to make us pay for our countertop which um our countertop which i've been showing y'all throughout my little videos or whatever that the countertop was peeling that's not on us because who the hell the lady making it seem like we just sitting up there picking stuff no woman she's talking about oh you guys must be using abrasive no i showed her the microfiber towels that we use i showed her the spray that i use to clean you know to wipe down like don't come for me sis but that was all taken care of because i hate being one of these people but i literally had to take it like above her pay grade and i hate doing that because it's just like i don't like to get people in trouble but boo we weren't finna pay no thousands of dollars just to fix a freaking countertop that i had already put in a complaint letting you guys know that it was pilling you guys did not notate the notate our notes i mean like put it in the notes and you guys actually told us not to worry about it because we were finna get ready to move but guess what we got that taken care of i just had to vent out there to you guys because lord duh let's just say like i'm so ready to move for military housing that i don't want to deal with military housing again like i honestly do not want to deal with mil this was our first and last time in the united states doing military housing and yeah because when we was in germany like we stay on post but if you told the germans like hey something is not working right something is broken literally they slow as hell but guess what they make sure they get your shit done all right all right so yeah what we about to do is go ahead and um i'm gonna go to this vegan donut spot guys i was supposed to be making us some pancakes but how are we gonna make pancakes when we missing half of the freaking ingredients i just thought about that yeah so we're going to this vegan spot then i'm going to the crystal store yeah, we're going to this vegan spot. Then I'm going to the crystal store. And then, um, I don't know. So we shall see. I know my neighbor's probably looking at me crazy because they literally like right in front of us and I got my camera sitting on my dashboard. But I don't give up two shits. So yeah, I just had it to vent to y'all. Let y'all know like what's been going on. I hope everybody like had a happy holidays that you and you guys enjoyed your work week. Um, like I said, I'm still, we're still in the process of moving. We were supposed to be going on November the 30th, but yet we're still here because my husband still has to clear. We're not leaving. Um, we're not leaving no time soon. I mean, by the time you got, no, 
but I'm gonna edit this video so it can be out so I can have something um, for it this week because I don't want to go on no little disappearance I mean you can go in the house if you want to no. okay um yeah so yeah I lost my whole train of thought I hate when I can feel somebody else's energy like I honestly hate that but anyways well, I'm about to go to the crystal store and then once I go from the crystal store I'm going to um to Bath and Body Works and then I'm gonna hit I'm gonna go to Target and once I leave from y'all just gonna come with me okay and then yeah if y'all see this um outfit in another video is because I am going to do another video with um PCS and tips for military doing this whole military move now that we got more information on how to do the full Diddy move by ourselves um I'm gonna do that for anybody who's gonna need help with doing it because literally looking on the internet for YouTube and like people tell you what it is but they don't tell you how to do it and I'm one of those type of people like get straight to the point like give me the details like give me the important information that I need I don't need to know what it is I know what it is I need to know how to do it so I'm gonna do a video on that Okay guys, so we made it to the um, the vegan restaurant. I mean, well, not vegan restaurant, but the, the vegan cafe. That's it right there. They are called Savage Goods. Um, I'll show you guys like the sign and stuff when we get in there, okay? But they are definitely really good. If you are in the El Paso area, they are definitely like, what the hell? girl they're definitely like really really good so let's go We just got done eating uh, we ate inside of the place the savage goods they were um, I asked could I you know record some some in there and they were actually really nice to let me record so like you guys can see inside of it and their food is definitely really good um, it tastes better than Dunkin Donuts and the coffee tastes better than Starbucks. So, like I said, if you are in the El Paso area, definitely come down here for like a mummy mother day, a little date, um, a little coffee date or something. Like something just to get out of the house. And it is downtown. It's kind of downtown El Paso. Um, it's um, north of it. So, yeah. But anyways, it's really it's honestly really really good so now on to the crystal shop i'm going to the same crystal shop that i always go to so that's where we finna get ready to go and i see y'all when we get in there
this is so cute. This right here is so cute. All right, <laughs> all right guys, we're back in the core. We finna get ready to go home. Oh, Y'all, I don't know why I got on this hoodie because it's so hot, literally, like, it is so hot. But anyways, um, I just turned on AC too. So, I'm hot. It's 60, well my car says 69 degrees right now. When I left the house, it was like 50, 50 something. Girl, where's my phone? Okay. When I left the house, it was like 54 degrees and yeah. My plan was to be back home at 1.30 and we finna be back home at like 1.30 something. So yeah, it's 60. Well, my car says 69 right now. It says 68. And when I left the house, it was literally like 59 degrees. Hopefully, I ain't got no white stuff on my lips. Uh, food. Uh, food. But anyways, y'all. So, we're done. Like, I'm legit. I'm going to go back to my house. Um, I have to finish packing. Uh, I'm not going to show that in here, y'all. <sighs> Ain't gonna show me packing like i think i showed enough for packing to be honest uh, what i will honestly do for you guys what i will honestly do is show you um like when we get ready to move out like i place the camera up show that we went to go get the truck and all of that stuff and see like can i place the camera up because i don't want to be um like it's gonna be me and my husband pulling all of their furniture in my car I went to Bath and Body Works and um, I got just one. Let me let me show you guys real quick. Let me see it. Thumbnail. <laughs> Thumbnail. <laughs> yeah, I'll be forgetting. So I got this. So I got this right here. I don't know if you guys can see it, but I got this, y'all. This right here smells so good. It was buy one item for 10 or more dollars, and then you get um, an item that's $13.50 for free. So I got that coupon in the mail. So um, this is for Nevaeh. So I got that for Nevaeh. So what I got, candle-wise, this one is mahogany vanilla. And it's giving me what I asked for, so. Okay, so it's um, Give Peace, and it's actually like, y'all. Like, I feel like I should've got at least three of these, but like I said, I wanna be frugal. Hopefully next year they have this because I think I have a, I think I have the mahogany teak wood in the house. I was gonna pick that one up too, but I end up putting, I just put it back. So anyways, the notes for this one is warm vanilla, fresh uh, bergamot, if I'm pronouncing that wrong, and then sweet sandalwood with natural essential oils. Now this candle got everything that i like vanilla and anything wood like i'm not burning it until we i'm not burning it until we get into our new place because i still have no my other one is done i think that one was called sweater sweater weather right that other candle that i had is called sweater weather i had that last year and i just finished that this year so yeah girl you good Oh, okay so yeah and then um what else oh i can show you guys my crystals since i'm right here in the house i mean since i'm right here in the house i went to target i just bought some sugar because we needed sugar and let me see the crystals and i just show you the crystals i did not buy um 
I did not buy a lot of crystals, to be honest. Because I actually went in there for one thing. But you know when you go in there with your kids, they always want something. But Nevada has been wanting this for the longest. And since we're leaving, this was my last time in the crystal store. I decided to just go ahead and get it for her. It's a desert rose. So it is a desert rose, which is really pretty. I'm trying to get my nails dirty. If my nails dirty, y'all, please don't judge me. So I got that for her, a desert rose. And then, like she, this girl, she wrapped this up so good, but I'm still gonna show you. Even though I'm gonna have to go back home and rewrap it. I end up getting a um, a black obsidian. Y'all see my camera right there? So I end up getting a black obsidian um, mirror. And I want to practice on skyring. If you guys don't know what that means, just go on Google and look at it. It's just so like you can see visions and messages and stuff. But yeah. So I don't know. Like I was looking into this and... I was gonna make my own skyring mirror and I just decided you know what they have it this literally was the last one and obsidian um, here and because we right by the border it actually this one is it is real it comes from Mexico so it comes from Mexico so yeah I just you know did my little thingy got this one y'all I'm obsessed like I went in there for a selenite because they claimed they had selen selenite for sale but it wasn't selenite it was actually satin spar I don't need any more satin spar I need authentic selenite so I didn't get it and I just grabbed this one I saw it I know I've been looking for it I was like let me just go ahead and get it um, since it's right here in my face so I just went ahead and I grabbed it. I got Nivelle, her desert rose. And actually what the girl did for us, for the desert rose, she actually took $2 off because Nivelle desert rose was supposed to be $4.95. She only charged me $2.95 for it. So she took $2 off. And then for my thing, um, she did give me um, military discount so she took off the extra two dollars plus uh, our whole entire order together she gave me a military discount of 10 percent which you know 10 percent is something so yeah let me go ahead and get home um it's right now it is 10 34 i would have been home right now if i wasn't talking but um, just trying to show you guys like what i got like i said if you guys see me in this outfit again like but I'm about to take out my military, I mean, not my military ID, but my card to get on post. So if you guys see me in this outfit again and you watch this video, whichever video comes first, just to know that I'm trying to get these videos out because next week we're going to be on the road for at least four days. So I have already been requested to... um like vlog our journey with us driving like how i'm feeling all of that yada 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 but yeah so i'm trying to get these videos out because the one with us moving is literally not going to be until we get to where we're going you guys won't see that one until we get to where we're going um each night that we stop at a hotel i try to do some editing uh, while i'm at the hotel but other than that if i can't then i would literally just wait until we get to where we're going we set up everything and i'll show you guys um our whole journey if you follow me on instagram i would do some like story times I will also put my Instagram down here I'll do some of my story times I'm trying to be more active on my social media platforms because I don't know you guys this is the year like I feel it we have been on YouTube since 2019 right 2000 no 19 
we have been on YouTube since 2019 or 18, one of those, uh, when we first moved to Germany and we started doing our Christmas markets. Am I where I want to be now today? The answer is no, I am not where I want to be on my channel, but I honestly feel like the more consistent I get, the better like I know viewers will come to me. And I'm honestly so grateful and so thankful for all of the, um, for all of the people who have been subscribed to re to me right now like y'all we got this like we honestly we got this i know i got this we got this i think everybody who watched my videos like i am so grateful for you guys who watch my videos i'm so grateful for everybody who subscribes to my channel you guys don't know how much it means to me when i wake up in the morning and i see that i got subscribers like more subscribers i'm also trying to think of more ways to bring to this channel um I have been holding off on bringing like my spiritual side to this channel. I don't know why, but I'm going to stop doing that because I feel like it's holding. I don't know what I'm scared for, but if I bring spiritual content to this channel and you don't like it, like if you see me say something spiritual, don't click on it. Thank you so much for rocking out with me today going to wherever that we needed to go and i would definitely see y'all in the next one this was just a me and Nevaeh type vlog today just you know like showing you guys around we didn't do much um we didn't do much at all but i honestly thank you guys so much for watching today's video and until next time guys